What's going on guys? Welcome back in another episode of Dub Monkey Garage. My name is Lucas. My name's Evan. And let's shit ourselves <laughs> in the background that fucking don't know what to say because I that's, haven't done it in so fair. long. I hope you guys enjoyed our new intro. If you did, make sure to smash like before we get on with this video. So and don't Lucas. forget about the subscribe button, you know, because yeah, I know we haven't been here in a while. Yeah, true. But we're here. We still have 560 uh, subscribers. So and thank um, you so much to all the subscribers that they're currently are subscribers, you know. Right. So what's today's video about, Lucas? So guys, basically all we want to talk about today is we have something special to show you. And one of those things is, as you know, myself and Evan, absolutely loves these of course and you know our buddy jacob he's a part of the dub monkey team you know and the truth be told you just couldn't catch up with us you know yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he was too slow what <laughs> he was a he was a mr slow on the last bash you know so he was yeah. like he felt quite uh quite intimidating and left know. behind yeah, yeah we were left. we were sending in in third gear and, and, he, was, he, and just he was in the smoke behind us <laughs> he felt like he was left behind we're gonna try a couple of clips there you know showing jacob being left in a smoke i'll leave um, some good ones as well myself <laughs> trust me we're gonna cut the good ones out <laughs> <laughs> and uh, so we want to show you something that we have been keeping away from you for a while but the jacob's new car is here she's here and she's fucking hot and let's show us you let's go to the footage evan better cut this out <laughs> he won't i'll think about it I hope you guys enjoyed that. That was, that's, it's a cool car, isn't it? It's a cool car. And now he's a zebra. Yeah, he's joined the zebra gang. Um, hey, hey, hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> hold on. He's, he's, he's a zebra. He's a zebra dude. now, like us. So hopefully there'll be a t shirt coming soon as well uh, with his Z so he can have. Yeah. But after, so you can, guys can get that as well. After it's done. Uh, link, link it for the merch in the description. <laughs> <for> the <laughs> make sure you buy. <laughs> right, right there, right there. Uh, yeah, make sure to go into our shop, you know, or see us on the track on the twenty second of October. I think so. I'll put, I'll put it on screen here. Okay, guys, you know, so what we're gonna do next? I'm gonna have a Jacob kind of taking you through the car to explain the whole reason why you bought a car. What is he gonna do with it? Show you around, and I hope you're gonna enjoy it. Let's get it. So guys, um, as you can see, this is my brand new Z. Basically still fresh. I'm still kind of too excited to kind of, you know, not come here every single day and not work on the car because there's always something to do with the car. And honestly speaking, this is probably the cheapest white body Z that you can buy on the planet. Honestly speaking, like the car, it probably looks okay from, from fire. It looks probably okay, but there's a lot of nicks, stuff like that around the, around the car. There's a bit of cracks in the white arches and stuff like that, but we'll get to those points. But yeah, in, the first, in the first point, I'd say like, obviously it's a 350Z. A 350Z is, you know, three and a half liter engines, 280, 200 horsepower, depending on if you have the HR model. But this is the DE, DE version, so Smoke 280. Machine. 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 So this is from Club Los gonna love it. He's gonna be like, send that train right now. <laughs> <laughs> Eric, if you're watching that, you know, we can't wait to see you guys in October, you know. So um there's a new addition to the family. So this is the the E version of the engine, this is a 2003 uh, Friday DC, so it's a Japanese import, which is the one I was sort of looking for. Wasn't looking for the UK version just because they're rusty, didn't want one. So this is the Japanese one. It has, as you can see, the full body kit, the uh, front rocker body bumper. It has a good stock rear bumper, if we can probably come around here. And as you can probably see as well, it has all white arches and side skirts, stuff like that. But I'd say probably visually, the main part is the big country lab wing. This it's is what's so so fucking big. <laughs> this is basically what told me. I was like, I've never seen a huge wing like this. And I was basically like, salt. So I basically just bought it. So you basically paid a few K, you know, for the wing. <laughs> <laughs> I paid a lot of the car for one wing. 
But yeah, it's uh, it's basically a sort of modified 3DZ. It has a stage three differential, sorry, stage three clutch. It has a light and flywheel. Um, it has a basic mod stock, uh, stock holder. In, sorry, it has a colder intake and also has a Mishimoto fan travel with two fans, which we'll go over there now with the engine. Uh, this is probably the main part that you that you want to have okay in the engine. Okay, so we'll back on. I'm just gonna flash. Yeah, so we have the cold air intake, which is basically a hot air intake at this point, which <laughs> I need to put a shroud around here because all the heat from the engine just goes into the intake and like you don't want that. You kind of have to do what I have done to mine, you know? Yeah. You'd be, you'd be actually laughing, but what we've done in mine, we found a piece of like aluminium steel that we had. We just actually, I think it was a barbecue tray or something. <laughs> it was like a barbecue that. tray. It was a barbecue tray, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shout out to um, Papa Trevor, Trevor Conlon. Thanks very much for hooking us up with the, with the barbecue tray. And it does the job, I have to say. It, we just know? bent it into place. That bent was it. it around and it, and it keeps the heat away, you know? That's what it you want. Works, it works. It works. <laughs> but then it broke down fix it. Exactly, you know? Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, basically, it's a stock engine. Just with a colder intake, but the main part that I'm really happy about is the Mishimoto fan shroud, which includes the two Mishimoto fans as well. So the car is very hard to heat up, it doesn't overheat or anything like that, and they cool the car a lot better than the stock fans. So, as you know, for drifting, the cars really, really get very hot. So, I'm very happy that this was has been already done to kind of accommodate for the cooling problems with the engines. But the, I need to do one more bit to the engine, which is basically the oil cooler and the power steering coolers, which are notorious for overheating, especially on the track when you're drifting, the power steering can basically boil and it will basically explode the reservoir. You if, you. if you're looking for a video on how to do that, we have one right here. So make sure to click there. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta plug the videos, guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> just, just filter them. Quick, 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 get in there. Let's go. Click, bait, click, bait. It's true. It's true. But yeah, other than that, the engine's basically stuck. Um, I am looking to put that plenum space around it yeah. in the future. Twin turbo as well, of course. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> no, no idea, man. <laughs> no. If, if, I want the, if I want the engine to explode in one drift event, then maybe I'll do that. But you I don't think... You would, yeah. But I say it probably explodes, so... Let's see if we can catch up with James Dean. You know? <laughs> yeah. I'll fucking fucking well. down a media <laughs> style <laughs> with the twin <laughs> turbos. You can blow up the engine. <laughs> Two laps around the fucking track, gone. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, and, and they did it the proper way as well. And, uh, they did, the, yeah. The but they did it in blue. like two days, so. Yeah. But they had the good parts for it as well, but still blue. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I actually, I got a question to ask, you know, while That's... we're here, you know, and sure. uh, everybody else is watching. What the hell is that thing there? The that corner? thing. What's this? Let's this, have is, a look. this is for the LED lights, I presume. I think this is a what? box for LED lights, I think. I don't know what that is. Is alarm? Or is it an alarm? It might be an alarm. This. I've never seen anything like that. But I think you're right, you might be enough. What's the alarm. fucking jalopy yeah, thing hanging out of it? Like, yeah. And it's right next to the hot part of the engine. <laughs> it looks like a fucking a spare fucking oil cap. <laughs> like, what the fuck is it? It's like, I'm just looking at it. You know? It does look like one. If anyone though, knows what that is, guys, please just comment down below because I'd be curious to see what you got to say. But I think the guys might be right. I think it might be an alarm. But it looks to me like some sort of like a control for like the fucking, lights or something uh, like that. What do you call it? <laughs> Grab a fucking uh, blow of valve or something. <laughs> for a minute, the guys. electronic one. It's <laughs> any, any I wish. <laughs> it has like a built in speaker inside. It's like everything like that. Imagine, it's like what well, Tesla's have the speakers in the engine way to make a sound. <laughs> Oh. It's a, it's a new school blow up, you know, not like back in the yeah, day. Yeah, yeah. New school. <laughs> it's like you know how the elect uh, how we go and slow into electric cars. It's basically like an electric blow up valve. Yeah, it's for electric, electric cars. blow up valve, you know. <laughs> oh, more noise, baby. Yeah. Oh, there's plenty of noise. So. Yeah, it actually does. Actually, would you mind giving a car a little start? I know we know it's late. We're here quite late. Yeah. So apologies to all the neighbors watching this, you know. But we're just gonna start it quickly, and you know? I'm not gonna do too much noise. Yeah, just do it. Just a little start. Just a little cost. Just a little 
taster of how it sounds because like we said about the neighbors and if you want to hear more just come down to mandela on the 22nd you know for the next bash you know and you'll you'll see some more you'll see all the three cars together guys you'll see myself evans and jacob's car there we're probably gonna have a couple of flats around as well. So for now, uh, so that's it. For now, what we're gonna do, we're gonna wrap up here, guys. You know, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you enjoyed to see us back in action. You know, there is gonna be more. I know we've been there late with all the, the videos for the last couple of weeks, you know, but we've been quite busy. This is gonna and, be um, Like below if you would like to see that or co comment below GK Tech if you wanna see the install of that. Um, I can. Okay. I can Basically, angle make sure that so. happens. It's a GK tag angle care. But for now, guys, thanks very much <laughs> for watching. If you're not subscribed to the channel yet, please make sure hit that subscribe button and we'll see you on the next one. Take care.